Okay guys, if you want to work out on how to print something, um, after you've made all your objects, now this one here is not finished, but I'm just going to teach you how to print. Um, what you do is you need to go down to the layout button. So see next to model you have layout. You should get this little screen here. Now, it'll probably be blank. So what you want to do first is go down here where it says paper and change that so it says model. That means that you can zoom in and out inside of this page and find what you've worked on. So make sure you zoom it in so it's appropriate so you can see everything. It has all your information you need. Once that's done, change it back to paper. Okay, we'll zoom in. And now, if you just move your mouse over what you want to change, double click it. You need to make sure you double click very fast. Change it so it has your name in it. You may need to center it, depending on what how, how it looks. You can change the date. So I'm going to make this one the 29th of the 9th, let's see, the 8th, 2013. Now it pops up this little error thing. What you do is just click Cancel. All right, and you can keep typing in what you want. Click OK. All right, change our title. So this one should be, make sure it's always in capitals. Intro to measurements. Oh, and I didn't quite fit, did it? So, if that doesn't fit, you can either try and shorten it. So, intro, we'll call this one introduction. Click OK. There you go. Now that's finished. We're not going to touch scale. You go up to A, print. Don't worry about any errors. Make sure you select the correct printer. I believe the one that you want is probably going to be the um, IT Lab photocopier. And then click OK and it should print out. Now you need to file that inside your folder. And that's it.